Perform Next 2022 and big massive machines. Woohoo! How are you doing, Joe? Good I'm doing to all see right. you again. It's good to see you again. This is my buddy Arez. You've seen him before. And now we're at the MassFit booth because there's something new and exciting to talk about. Today, I want to show you our new groundbreaking technology, which we call Cast in Motion. Cast in, in motion. motion. Exactly. Remember that last year I introduced you the GDP, the gel dispensing printing, in which we are That's printing right. totally hollow power that was printed this way, no support structure, and this is totally hollow. Okay, nothing here inside. So we decided to take the technology to the next level. Okay. We say, wait a second, why not print a part? <laughs> Remember, we're printing hollow. Right. So we had an idea to print the shell the whole part from water breakable material, print several layers, let's say about half an inch or so, or one centimeter, and cast inside materials. This is a shell. This is a shell, so we build several layers, and then we cast. Print and cast, print and cast. Casting at the time of printing. And we are taking very special materials, I will talk about the first materials that we are releasing today, at the, at the end of the printing process, we take this part, we dip in the water, and then this white shell fall apart. Water breakable. Breakable, okay. Yeah. It's simple tap water. It's not contaminating the water and everything. And at the end of the uh, soaking process, you get a part. May I? Yeah, of course. This is what's inside of that shell that you just showed me. Exactly. And this was built in layers, in it was in motion. In this motion. This was built in motion. Exactly. And this is an example of an eye end material that is used for a mold for composite, like oh. carbon fiber. And exactly. you, you did talk about CNC milling. So rather than milling from a, a block mm -hmm. and subtracting material, you're only using the material that you need. Exactly. Allow me to show you some of the molds that we have here in our boot, and you understand how we compress the time to a friction of a time, what takes literally months to days, seriously. That's huge, that's huge, months to days. Absolutely. All right, let's, let's see it. Let's go see it. Okay, do you know how this thing is being created? Take a very good look on the geometry of this thing. If you wanna make it from carbon, this geometry is impossible. Okay, so normally something like this, I don't see how you could mold this you would have to make it in two parts because your mold on the inside is gonna be trapped. Exactly. So what we are doing actually, we can print with the same technology, the cast in motion, the water breakable part. It just breaks away. It breaks away. And then and you're then left you have, with this. You can have a drone exhaust. All drones need exhaust, let's exactly. be honest. Yeah. Very fast. Are you ready for this? We're gonna introduce additional materials. Okay. For example, you know, Everyone is taking care today about the circular economy. Okay, and, I understand. And you know, every factory creates sawdust. Oh, right, wood factory. Wood, wood factories factory. create a bunch of sawdust. So what we can do here, we can take the sawdust and actually cast it inside the shell and literally create furnitures. Wait, so this is a, this is a seat. This is for my, a seat for a bicycle. This is a bike seat. It can be also like a handle. You can see over here, okay? Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. This is wood. This is recyclable wood that was 3D printed. We take the recyclable wood, the sawdust. Well, okay, recyclable. This was sawdust, Erez. This, this is this sawdust. This was sawdust, and you put it in to your uh, cast in motion, and you have a binder here, I would imagine. Exactly. But this, this is wood. It feels like wood. Yeah, it does feel it like wood. It warms like wood. It smells like wood. It is warm like wood. And this is just another small example that I cannot bring with me here, but just to show you what we can do with it. So we can literally print tables and furnitures, not tomorrow morning. No, but, these, but, but it's possible. and. Not tomorrow morning, but soon. Like I, when I'm working with wood, like I've thrown away a lot of sawdust. We have dust collection systems that collect sawdust into bags that we then throw away. So with this, that sawdust becomes a raw material. Exactly. <laughs> Wait a second. I did not finish with you for today. Oh. This is just the beginning. Okay. 
that's pretty cool. Like, I don't know how you can top that, because that's kind of cool. I know that you like fancy showers and I, sink. I do. I like to wash my hands and sink. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah. So we can take marble stone powder, and in the same concept, 3D printed it in our shell. This is stone. This is marble stone? This, this feels like stone. It's cold like stone. This is stone. Exactly. Honestly, like I, I understand the process that we're talking about, casting in motion, taking powders and you know, mixing them with a binder and, and putting it together, but but it's still it has an organic feel to it. It looks like stone. And and imagine the additional materials that we can bring in the future. Well anything we can powder, we can print with. Exactly. This is gonna change some things, man. Absolutely. Erez has shown me amazingly cool things, and uh, I would be remiss if I didn't have my own cool thing to show you and possibly give for you to take home. It's not 3D printed stone, and it's not 3D printed wood, but I still think it, it holds some value. It's gonna, it'll keep you warm. Here, would you hold that? Let me grab it for you. Do you remember? Yes. You wore my hoodie last time we met. Really? And you yeah. enjoyed it. Wow, that was so cool. What if? Yes. You had one of your own. Woohoo! Whoa! Whoa, whoa, wait a second. I want to try it right now. Yeah, try it on here. Thank Let's try you it on. so much. Yeah, look at that. Thank you so much. I'm going to put it on my suit. There you go. It might be a little bit big, but you are a big personality, and so I think it'll fit. Yes. Whoa! That's amazing. Look at that. Oh, look at that. Look at this guy. Woohoo! Well, Erez, people are going to want to know more about this wonderful stuff you told me about. Look into that camera right there, right there, yes. right there, and let Thank them know you. where to go. Thank you so much, Joel, for this lovely present. I really like it. I'm a big fan of your YouTube channel. I'm a fan of you. All right, but tell them where to go to find out more information about all this wonderful stuff. You are all welcome to visit Joel Twang YouTube channel, the best YouTube channel in the world. <laughs> but where else can they go? Where else can they where go? They, you know, they, they, would you have a website? Of course, they can visit also Massivit website. And I'll put a link in the description just in case they don't want to type it out. Absolutely. Arez, I love you, bro. I love you Thanks so for much. letting Thank us stop so by, much. man. Thank you so much. Have a good rest of Form Next. Thank you so much.